Hey friends. All right. This week we're going to be talking about our friend Noah. Um, this story will be found in Genesis 6 verses 5 all the way through chapter 7 into verse 5. All right. And so first of all, remember who the first man and woman were? Adam and Eve. That's right. So God created Adam and Eve and they lived in the Garden of Eden and they talked with God every day. But one day Adam and Eve did something they should have they had never done before. They disobeyed God. They were given this beautiful garden and told that they could eat anything in the garden except eat from the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. And if you disobey and eat the fruit, you're going to die. And what do you suppose Adam and Eve did? They disobeyed God and ate the one thing that God told them not to do. They disobeyed God and God was so sad. Because they disobeyed, they had to leave the garden forever. And God was so sad. But remember, we said God had a plan to redeem them. But Adam and Eve had many children. They had many, many, many children, and these children grew up and had families, and their children grew up and had families, and after a very, very long time, there were many people living on the earth, and all the people were like Adam and Eve. They all had hearts that did not want to obey God. They had yucky sin in their heart. They all did bad things. Only a few of the people came to God and told him they were sorry for their bad things. But most of the people in the world had forgotten about God. They were very, very sad and angry in their hearts, and they didn't want anything to do with God. They all started doing very bad things. Sin was so bad that God had to do something. He decided to flood the whole earth and start over. That is so sad. God was so sad that his whole creation had turned against him. Everything that he made, that he made so good and perfect through disobedience allowed sin to come into the world and then it wreaked havoc. And God had a plan, but God was also very frustrated with the fact that his people that he created forgot about him. And so God decided he was going to send an earth, a flood to clean the whole earth and to start over. God looked down from heaven to see if there was anyone righteous and he was only able to find one man. He found one man and that was Noah. God decided to tell Noah about his plan to flood the earth. And God even went a step further and told him to build a huge boat with many rooms in it. He told him, I will protect you and your family. I will keep you safe if you do exactly as I say. 